Net Mums is a website that's been set up for mums, um, by mums, um, and one of those mums that set it up is me, and it's really based on my own experience. When I first had children, I found that my family were actually in Ireland, my best friends lived in a different part of the country, my co-workers that I used to go to the pub with were still at work, and I actually found, you know, I was quite isolated, as in I didn't have a ready-made group of mum friends to talk to. And when you have children, literally from the time that you're pregnant to, you know, probably to the time that your children, you know, leave home, you really get your, your best support and advice from other mums. You want to actually go through the day-to-day -day trials and tribulations, the ups and downs of your pregnancy, the ups and downs of your baby's life, the day-to-day -day events in your life with somebody else who understands. And even another mum who perhaps has been through it, you know, years ago, like your mum, doesn't quite understand. I can remember saying to my mum, um, you know, my baby won't sleep, why? And she went, oh, I can't remember, it was a long time ago. So you really do need people who are going through, you know, other mums who are going through the same things as you. Um, so that's what NetMums really set up to try and do. It's a website that has now got over half a million mums, all sharing the, you know, the good times and the bad times, the ups and downs of daily life together. Um, there's a real localised element to NetMums, because one of the things that you need as a mum is to know a lot more about your area. You want to know where the local mum and toddler groups are, um, where the baby's swimming, the nicest swimming pool to take your baby that perhaps isn't, you know, the water is warmer, or you want a baby gym class. As your children get older, you want to know where the best preschools are, which primary schools, which catchment area you're in. So it's all that kind of localised knowledge, and you don't actually get that until unless you have other mums to ask who, who have that knowledge. But you need to actually meet the mums in order to get that knowledge, and where do you meet the mums? So NetMums has a big element of bringing mums together locally and sharing information. So what we found was that when you put over half a million mums together on a website, the same issues come up regularly, um, and the same, com you know, the same issues were being discussed by the mums on the website so regularly that we thought, how do we actually en encapsulate this information? How do we capture this wonderful advice that's being passed on every day between mums? How do we bring it all together so that it's it's there for the next generation or the next bunch of mums that come along, you know, next week and ne next month and next year, so that they can use the same information that's being shared today. Um, and that's when we spoke to the, the publishing company Headline, um, and they believed that there was actually you know, such amazing material here for a set of books. And that's where the Net Mums publications, the Net Mums books came from. So they literally start and take you right through from the time that you're pregnant, right through to, to when your children are you know, in, in leaving primary school. So through the first sort of 10, 12 years um, of your children's lives. So the first book, naturally, is a book about pregnancy, and it's called Your Pregnancy. And it's all about having a baby. It's all about, you know, literally from, from, from well, from preconception um, through those, those nine, well, it's actually not nine months, it's nine and a half months, right through to, to the time that you deliver your, your precious baby into the world. Um, it's filled with loads of, of conversation, hints and tips from other mums, but it's also backed up by advice from an expert because you, you do need both, you know, peer-to-peer -peer advice and support, um, knowing what other mums have been through is, is you know, or are going through and sharing sizes of bumps and experiences is so important, but you also do need the expert advice as well. You need to know, you know, if what you're experiencing is normal, you need somebody to, to allay your fears, um, any little niggles and worries you have, you need somebody to tell you, you know, if it's normal or when to seek advice. Um, and this book does all of that, so it gives you the, it's, it's a bit like an antenatal class in a book, really. It's, you know, you're going along, you're meeting a whole load of other parents who are going through the same thing, but you also have somebody leading you and guiding you through it at the same time. There's loads of kind of interactive bits and pieces, little quizzes and things to keep you, um, you know, fully engaged with the experience and also things to write down so that you have it as a memento of your pregnancy afterwards. So literally the minute your baby's born, the pregnancy book gets tossed out the window and you wonder why it was ever such an important thing to you because actually, you know, the pregnancy is, is nine months, at the time it seems like nothing else matters and suddenly the baby's here and, you know, this book's gone, it's no use anymore and that's when baby's first year comes in. Um, and this book is literally takes you from the minute your baby is born through that you know emotional roller coaster that is the first year of your baby's life through the you know the joy the tears the ups and downs um, and again it's you know bursting with a, a room full of best friends who've been through the same experience as you who when you're feeling you know a bit tearful or when you're feeling a bit high when you're feeling excited you can come to this book and go gosh you know all these mums went through the same thing again lots of expert advice as well because particularly the first time you have a baby you're, you're just overcome with worries are you doing the right thing is your baby you know is everything developing normally um, you, you know constantly need somebody you can refer to and this book is just basically your best friend through the whole first year of your baby's life you have a completely different set of worries 
um, and concerns and questions in the first month as you do in, in, in sixth month. I mean, literally by, by the sixth month, you've forgotten what the first month was like. Um, so it's not something that somebody can, can give you advice and that will carry you through. You need something that you can constantly refer back to that is dealing with where you are now. And this book lo literally looks at the baby's first year, month by month, week by week. Not just the baby, though, not just your baby's development, but you and your emotions, what's going on for, for mum as well as for her baby. But what about you? What about mum? Um, and that's absolutely what Netmums is all about. Netmums is very much built around the mum. It's mum-centric uh, rather than baby-centric because we do honestly believe that a happy mum will equal a happy husband, a happy family, and ultimately a happy community. So this book is very special to Netmums. It's called How to Be a Happy Mum. And it deals with the, the main issues that a mum faces once she becomes a mum. Because we tend to think that everybody else knows what they're doing. Everybody else you know, has either always been a mum or always knew how to be a mum. But actually, it's, n it's not true. We're all the same. We're all learning as we go along. And this is just bringing you some advice from mums who've been there, um, who've been through it and who've survived. Things like renegotiating your relationship with your partner, um, how to make sure that you find time for each other as well as for the baby, how to deal with things like whether you go back to work or not to go back to work, or whether you have to go back to work, how you're going to deal with that. The issues that you face as a mum, sometimes you feel stressed, sometimes you feel depressed, sometimes you feel isolated, sometimes you're not sure which direction to take. And this book just covers all of those issues. Again, it's like a room full of best friends who've been there, um, who've negotiate, negotiated those difficulties, um, and some expert advice as well. I think it's really important to remember that we're not called upon to be perfect mothers, we're just asked to be good enough mothers. But having young children is also supposed to be one of the happiest times of our lives and we sometimes forget that in the daily struggle to be a perfect mom we forget actually to enjoy it to enjoy our children and often if you meet an old lady out on the street they'll say oh you know enjoy every minute of it it goes so fast and you think Does